Watch the entire video my lovely viewers, I mean from start to finish, to get the whole thing. Without wasting much of your time, let's get right into it. Hi lovely viewers, it's me again, your one and only Mtati Mpundu. Welcome to my YouTube channel. If this is your first time on my channel, kindly subscribe to my YouTube channel by hitting the red subscribe button down below and turn the bell icon to join the notification squad. Don't forget to like, share and leave a comment. Tell me what you think about this video in the comment section below. I'll be super glad to hear from you lovely viewers. So, I know some people who say, no, but you said you are not going to be talking. You're not going... No, 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 no. Huh? Don't get confused. Uh, don't get confused. Uh, no, no, you said you're not going to talk. Eh? You're not going... Uh-uh. Uh-uh. Relax. I, I didn't say I'm not going to be talking. I didn't say I'm not going to be talking. I will continue talking as a public lawyer. What I refuse is that I will not be biased, you know, talking for people in a... You know, no, that's, that's basically what I... I will not be biased towards anyone because at the end of the day the people that uh, I speak for uh, you don't pay my bills mm? I'm your public lawyer but you don't pay retainer fees eh? you pay you pay the lawyers in court but you don't pay the public lawyer so I'll just be the public I'll continue being a public lawyer and giving my comments based on what I think, based on what I think, without you know having a having a bias, I will not be biased towards anyone. That is the point. So don't come here expecting Chilufatari to speak for you. Ah uh ah, -uh. nakana. When you come here, expect Chilufatari to speak his mind, to speak the way he sees things, to speak what he thinks about a particular issue, whatever particular issue that will be coming in this country, I'll be speaking from my own point of view, from my own point of view. And I have put up, I have put um, uh, that, uh, um, that heading. You know, when I look at, um, uh, President uh, Haka Inde Ichilema and uh, Edgar Chagwalungu, the way they look, they treat their opponents. We have had now a privilege of having Haka Inde Ichilema in government. Before he was in opposition and now he's in government. Edgar Lungu was in government, now he's in opposition. And when I look at these two, when I look at these two, I don't think they are any different. These two, President Haka Inde Ichirema and Edgar Chagwalungu, I don't think they are any different. They are pretty much the same in the manner that they treat their, their opponents. They fix. Edgar in terms of um, uh, opponents, he was fixing them. Edgar Chagwanungu, when he was in power, he was fixing opponents. Those that he, uh, criticized him in a manner that he didn't like, those that said things that he didn't like, he was fixing them. I was fixed by President Edgar Chagwanungu. Haka Inde Ichirema was fixed by Edgar Chagwanungu. A number of other opposition, they were also fixed when Edgar Chagwanungu was in power. This is a fact. We can go there and look at uh, uh, history. It will show us that these people were fixing. Even even some of, uh, of course, even some of those who were uh, yesterday giving solidarity. Uh, even my good Sean Tembo was 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 was, was, was hammered. They fix. He was fixing. Haka in the Ichirem has also come in. He's also fixing his opponents. He's fixing, including Edgar Chagwalungu. He's fixing him. 
the same way Edgar Chagbadungu fixed uh, Haka in the uh, Haka in the when he was in opposition. The only difference which I see between these two is that Haka in the is more expressive. When Haka in the uh, doesn't like you or he wants to fix you, he's very open. You even have a press conference and talk about you, and tomorrow you'll be followed. <laughs> tomorrow you'll be fixed. Yeah, uh, there are a number of there are a number of examples that I would give you. Uh, it's only me that he, he doesn't mention directly. For me, he fixes me, you know, quietly if, without uh, bringing up my name. But these others. <laughs> Bomani, he mentioned, who is this guy? Who, who does he think he is? And he went and he fixed him. Miringolungu, who is this guy? He went and he fixed him. Uh, this, the DPP, didn't see you, who is this woman? He went and he fixed him, fixed her. Uh, Joe Malanji, who is this person? Uh, Bonanza, Bonanza, he went and fixed him. So, and he, recently he said, Oh, Ningu Fati Rewera, Polewera, Po. We will torach in Jeming Garato. And yesterday, but Edgar Lung was fixed through the wife. So, Haka in the Ichirema is quite open. He is quite, he comes out, he tells you, I'm gonna fix you, and you get ready for it. Now, with the Edgar Chagalungu, Mdala, all those who are fixed, you will never hear Edgar Chagalungu mention your name. Never. He will not mention the name. He will not say this one. Uh uh. No. But people were being fixed. You see the difference? They are all fixing. Edgar Chagalungu was fixing. You are an opponent. You become an opponent to Edgar Chagalungu. He will fix you. But he will not come out in open to say, this guy, I'm going to fix him. He will not say it. But Haka in the Ichirema, you are his opponent. He will fix you, but he will even tell you, I'm going to fix you. This is the difference. And you, you will see it very, very clearly. But another important, that I, another important point that I've seen between these two is that, you know, Haka in the Ichirema, from the way I'm seeing, two years in power. You know, this man comes out very strong. Eh? He talks tough. How can the HDM talks tough? Eh? And even his face when he's talking, you actually get scared. When how can the HDM is talking, you get scared. But this is not from just from what I'm seeing. Haka in the HDM, much as he has that face, that scary face, with a strong voice, that will scare you. I think he, have a, he has a soft spot. He has a soft spot. Haka in the HDM has a soft spot. Behind that big voice, behind that threatening face, there is a soft spot. There is a soft man behind, behind that. This is what I've seen. This is what I've seen. There is a soft spot behind that strong voice, behind that big talk, that scary face. There is, there is a soft spot. And uh, I, I will substantiate my point. But on the other hand, when you look at Edgar Chagwalungu, Edgar Chagwalungu, he doesn't, uh, you know, he doesn't come out, threaten you. Uh -uh. No, 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 he doesn't. He doesn't come out to threaten you. Edgar, Edgar Chagwalungu doesn't talk tough. When he was president, he was not talking tough. No. But he was fixing. And when he fixes you, ah, I think I'm done by Edgar Chagwalungu. I come to my Karibako. Ah, Wadi Kosako. Wadi Kosako. Why do I say this? Why do I say this? Look, at least for myself, the first time that I was arrested during the Edgar Chagwalung, I stayed in Marcel's nine days. I stayed in Marcel's nine days. 
nine days I stayed muscles eight days muscles and the and the um, one day could remind eight days where people not talking people are talking and I thank you for those of you who are talking people are talking and so on and so forth other people were also arrested for a number of days a number of days Haka in the HLM himself was arrested together with an, a number of people the people of southern province you remember the the the, the, the wife to chief mukuni the queen you remember and that group a number of people were being arrested and thrown and thrown muma cells they used to last they used to stay there they used to stay there this is a fact you go back and check you find that a number of people that were arrested and thrown in muma cells during the time of Balung, they stayed longer muma cells they stayed longer muma cells especially if you are directly in conflict with the with president edgar Lung, you will stay longer you will stay longer but this time around this time around look at a number of people that uh, uh, a number of people who are being arrested how many days they are staying in muscles myself yes i've stayed in muscles the, um, i've stayed during my by hh the longest i've stayed in muscles is eight days I stayed there eight days. But I think I'm the longest. I don't see any any of the the leaders, any of the leaders in opposition who has stayed eight days. Katush, I stand to be corrected. Of course, the issue of Bamumbipiri, that is another issue. The issue of Yabamumbipiri, that's another issue. But look around how many of these oppositions have stayed my wife will you buy in general later okay when i'm when i'll be coming i'll buy okay mm. if you look they are not staying that long sean tembo imagine what sean tembo let's face it imagine what came out during the time of you know what Sean Tembo was arrested for imagine how he came out and whatever whatever imagine if it was during that balloon I mean Sean Tembo was arrested was it on on Thursday on Thursday and I think he came out was it uh, uh, he came out on Tuesday I think so you can say Thursday Friday Saturday Sunday Monday Tuesday was it six days or five days so I'm seeing that uh, you know balalekelako somehow he pounces but i think is is soft balalekelako people are being let go you know balalekelako but kuri balungu mm, yaleka kanako yaleka kanako you know again when you look at uh, ama court cases it, during the time of ayed galungu those who were charged with the, the so-called defamation of the president it was no joke defamation of the president people were jailed a number of people were jailed and the way they were making sure that they push their points they were making sure they were preparing they were really preparing and they were moving fast remember how many people were jailed for this so-called a crime of defamation of the president i remember myself i would have been in jail eh? i remember that one came and rescued me it was a hard it was hard Mtembonchito sweated he fought so hard despite being the former dpp being a state council it was it was ruthless they came to my house they searched i mean it was just something else so truth be told much as these people they are not different they are fixing opponents 
but I'm seeing that how can they eat them? Could you go soft spot? Could you go soft spot? I don't think he's as bad as we see him or or what we hear. They perceive the, the what we hear. I'm not saying he doesn't fix. Please get me right. I'm not saying he doesn't fix. He fixes, but at least the treatment naipsanako. Treatment naipsanako. Yes, I've been treated badly. I've been treated badly. I was taken to Lukulu and whatever. But namuli wa lungu muine namona adichuri there. And awe yale moneka very tare moneka win tare moneka win. Umumuri government somehow na mwana na cases opo bata mpira how many people have been jailed it's two years down the line how many people have been jailed how many people have been jailed under under haka inde ichilema let's just be honest how many people have been jailed compared to how many people were jailed go and check the statistic during waedi gachagolungu compare haba ale ingira mjere bale ingisha Uriana nika ne tuku tanefia nefintu fiako ali ingire mjere Nani nani Vale ba, ingisha Vale kaka I know I've got cases as well I'm going to court But ka treatment kariko different Kariko different This is my view Kariko different So I'm just saying You know as much as we When we talk and what and what and what we should also when we cry victim when we cry victim we should also look at uh, who we are we should also look at who we are and what we did we should honestly this is just a fact so coming to the issue of yesterday firstly truth be told eh? truth be told firstly that case, from my point of view, shouldn't have escalated to where it is. That case shouldn't have escalated to where it is. That case, trust me, this is not a case of of politics. No, let's be let's be realistic. Let's be realistic. Let's be honest. This case, where it started, there were no politics. Where it started, there were no politics. This case started between two parties. Two parties. I will not go down to start explaining the details of it. I will not go down to that. I will leave that to the courts if it will go to court. But from my point of view, this is a case that should not have reached where it has reached. It has reached this to this point because both parties they were flexing muscles apart it is about who is powerful two parties who is powerful who is more connected that's what it is e casey e casey it is about who is connected who is powerful because at first when they entered into those negotiations there were negotiations there was the issue of the money. I don't want to go into the details. I don't want to go into the details. But when that issue, when those disputes of over money came in, when they sat to start agreeing, to start agreeing, one party appeared more powerful than the other. And in this instance, at that, when they started negotiating, The Lungu family appeared more stronger than, than the other party. When they started, it appears that the Lungu family appeared more powerful than the other party. And uh, I, I wish there was good consideration. Good consideration. And please don't challenge me. I am being very careful in the manner that I'm, that I'm, I'm discussing this. I wish there was consideration. I wish there was consideration. And some of these things, I actually brought them out. 
to some of the parties even before i spoke about this case i warned some of the parties in this case that they would have taken better measures but they didn't they didn't i thought i think they felt that you know they are okay they are secure you know they they have got the powers they are powerful if i could put it that way unfortunately they didn't realize that president edgar lungu was no longer in state house if edgar chagalungu was in state house the other party truth be told the other party would have gone to jail if edgar lungu was in was in was in power the other party today as we speak those people would have been in jail they would have been in jail if i told edgar lungu was in power those people would have been in jail and i don't think there would have been a consideration and even when they were discussing when they were doing whatever they were doing they should have made consideration made considerations in a, you know there are sometimes when people have done something wrong to you or something has gone wrong you know you find a way of sorting it out without you know escalating it but the stance that they took they took a stance a strong stance looking at their status unfortunately the other party the other party found some connection with the current government they found some connections with the current government and when they found some connection with the current government they also gained power they gained power when they gained power hence now we shall see who is who so uh, panomba it is about who is who at first oh you have done this to me or oh, you will see that's what happened i'm going to get this i'm going to do this i'm going to do this to you because you have done this to me and those afterwards they realize oh okay so this is what you have done to us okay we shall see we will also go to the power that be this is what this case is all about they flex the muscles the at uh, the, the lungus flex their muscles now these ones also they are flexing their muscles it's we shall see okay that's what you did oh you got us our, you got our vehicles oh you got a oh okay okay fine let's see who is who you think you are powerful they went to power that be and the power that be and now have now swung into action so in in any what i'm basically saying is that this is not about politics it's about flexing muscles who is who who is who that is what it is that is what this case is all about and i am i am avoiding discussing details one you know point by point if i were to do i mean in in bemba they say i mean um, i love uh, edgar lungu i love especially my mother esther i love her very much i wouldn't want to come here in public and talk uh, carelessly but basically at this at least i can mention that i wish there was consideration kuma first kula ku inekulia i wish they had considered those people in a better way than what is happening now and those people also i wish they could also have a consideration of where they are coming from what really happened than to use the power because now they are connected so i hope you are getting me very clearly there i'm saying i wish by edgar lungu and the family had made some consideration when they were fighting this case when kurakune kuma first school i wish they had done that but they didn't now these people also because they are now they are connected to the power that be i also wish they could have some consideration other than what is happening so bottom line i would say this is not a political matter uh -uh. let's let's be real this is not fixing uh edgar chagwalungu 
because I live with No, it's not political, you know. It's not politically moot. Yes, the politics has come in, but where it started, it was not political. It was not political. It is about flexing muscles. It is about flexing muscles. The 50 50. Oh, who is who? Tuala Mona, who is who? That is how I'm seeing this case. If I were to give any advice to anyone, I would say, we are human beings. We don't need to treat each other, you know, uh, uh, ruthlessly because of the position that we have. It is not right. That, that is for me. We are human beings. Each time we have an issue, let us try to resolve that issue um, humanly. Not to, not to uh, use the powers because we are advantaged in one way or the other. And we use those, uh, the powers that we have to treat others uh, ruthlessly. That is, that is, that is what I am saying. If there is any counsel that I would give is that when we have, when we are privileged, we are in a certain position where we are privileged. Please, even if somebody is wrong, can we have some consideration? Can we have some consideration? Let us not, you know, finish them because we are powerful. No, it's not good. Because you just never know what tomorrow will bring. You may be powerful today, but tomorrow you may not be powerful. That's basically what I'm saying. You may be powerful today. Tomorrow you may not be powerful. So please, you have the powers use that power uh, moderately consider others consider others don't just know because i'm powerful i can do this because i can do this i can do this tomorrow you may not have the powers or tomorrow there might be somebody who will be more powerful than you that is my point that is not that is my point whatever position that you have please have consideration for the other person who may not be that powerful at that point? Because if you use your power, because many kwata maka, oh, watch TV. Me, me, I'm, 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 I'm former, I'm former first lady. You can't do this to me. I will show you. I, will, you know, no. Make some serious consideration. Make some some consider serious consideration. Sometimes you even let go of certain things. Sometimes you even let go of certain things. I mean, it could be money. Sometimes you can even lose. You let, just let go. Especially when we talk of being Christian. When we talk of being Christian, at which point do we forgive? Do we say, okay, it's okay, let it go. Let it be. Let it be. So at which point are you going to say, let it be? You know, because that is what we learn in Christianity. When we say we are Christians, Christianity is about forgiving. Christianity is about letting go. That is what Christianity tells us. If somebody owes you, you know, as a Christian, sometimes you say, it's okay, let it be, let it go. That's what Christianity is. There is no Christianity in making sure that somebody pays. No, you did this to me. You will pay. That is not Christian. That is not Christian. That is not Christian. You will pay. You, you have done this. You will pay. No? That is not Christian. So, from my point of view, and this is for everyone, that when you are advantaged, please consider those that are less, that... That are not as that are not as privileged as you are. Regardless of what they have done to you, consider. Because you don't know tomorrow your position. At first, but first lady, truth be told, she was the first lady. She was the former first lady. Now, this other party now, because they have got connection, now they can also push an agenda. Now they can also push an agenda. But what will happen tomorrow? 
will the power that these people have which they which they have borrowed from wherever they have borrowed will will it be there tomorrow will it be there tomorrow this is about this is just what this issue is all about it's not about politics it's not about politics then about yesterday's release I mean putting the the the, the, the Esther Lungu in in Muma cells that was not necessary that was not necessary it was not necessary it was not necessary at all it was not necessary it was not necessary but that is where now the politics come in that is where the fixing come comes in but then but esther was released kuma 21 hours that's when she was released and we are seeing people being released oh, for the first time eh? where we are coming from we never never we couldn't imagine somebody being released oh, no 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 after 18 hours why she but you alala it is in this government i don't remember any any time when people were released during the time of Vaid Galungu, I don't remember. I don't remember. Now, one would say, no, pressure, pressure, pressure. For me, I think uh, this is where the soft spot of Haka Inde Ichidema comes in. Yesterday, yes, it was bad that uh, that uh, you know, but Esther Lungo was put in muscles. It was not necessary. Because they would have arrested her, they would have given her bond, she would have gone home. But they put her inside. And the intention was to make her sleep there. But whatever happened, whatever you may consider to be pressure, I don't think it is pressure. Me, I want to say it is a soft spot in Haka in the Hichilema. There is a soft spot. He listens. Contrary to Vaed Galungu, Vaed Galungu tawale umfwa. Vaed Galungu vale chita fix. Vale chita fix mdala. Tawale, vale chita fix. Fueva, fueva churileko. We know what we are talking about. Tamwari ulu se. Tamwari ulu se. Tamwari ulu se. Tamwari ulu se. Inanari churileko te timbepe. Tamwari ulu se. Not that I'm bitter, no. I'm telling the facts as it is. But this time around, Kuliko, there is that consideration. Whether it is pressure, but at the end of the day, we have somebody at least Ule Umfwa. Ule Umfwa. By Edgar Lungu Mdala. Nganabaku Vika Kuleft, even now. Ngabaku Vika Kuleft, Nikuleft. Ngabaku Vika Kuleft, Nikuleft Mdala. But at least HH, if this is what it shows because we have situations where people are being released Ushiku. they are being released Ushiku. i have been released Ushiku myself i remember one time at force headquarters i was released quite late i was released um uh, sean tembo was released quite late uh, but fred member was released quite late but my wife Esther Lung was, was released quite late. It is, you, one would say it is pressure. No. Nga kuriba lungu, she kwenye takwa leva pressure. Kuriba lungu na kwenye takwa leva pressure. But mwari mwana po muntu wa mchita release ushiku. Eh? Because wanungu nga, nga lava kanati, na chipwa, na chipwa, forget it mdara. Mpaka mailo, or whatever day. So, this for me, I think uh, as much as I am condemning, not that I'm agreeing to my, to my Esther Lungu being myself, I am not agreeing. But at least when there was, when people spoke, which what you, if you want, you can say pressure. I don't think Haka Inde Ichinema will be pressured by the, by people singing uh, at, uh, at the police or by uh, Edgar Lungu being there. I don't think. If he wanted, he would have just gone to sleep. Even today, we would have been discussing this issue. You know, there is not a soft spot. Kuliko a soft spot. 
muri ba Edgar Lungu ba yaba ntu wale pangecho ngu bali nga ma tear gas fea lirile tear gas tear gas tear gas tear gas even lives would have been lost that's how lives was, were lost because when crowds came in to give support what used to happen ni nishama tear gas ya ambo kulira ni mpolo polo shambo kulira you see the difference you see it objectively speaking mwa pena pena kuli walungu you put up that uh, what happened there nga nimuli walungu nga kwa liyama tear gas nga tabai kerepo pari no mba pari ya mdala na mwana ma pictures bali ya nwako na 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 no 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 tume nshi utuma kofi shan shani they are beating drums awe that is something different something different and i'm saying it here I want wa haka inde ichirema to be encouraged. That's why I'm saying it here. I want wa haka inde ichirema to be encouraged. That yes, Bamdala, myself I've said a lot of things and I've, I used to look at you quite, that you are a very ruthless man. I used to think that you are a very ruthless man. But I don't think you are that ruthless. Mwani kwa takwa kamutima. I'm not saying you are not a dictator. Ah, we. Ah, 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 ah. Please, get me right. I'm not saying you are not a dictator. You are fixing. You are fixing. But, akamutima na mkwatako. Na mkwatako. Yes, you talk tough and whatever, whatever. But, akamutima na mkwatako. Ino ndefo wa michite encourage wa mdala wa wahaka inde ichirema. That please, don't listen to those people who are saying, Nah, you are succumbing to pressure. You are succumbing to pressure. Ah, we mdala. Continue being human. Continue being human. Like I've said, we we have evidence in the past. When people gathered giving solidarity and whatever, whatever, we have evidence. Pa, pa, pa high court, somebody was shot. Pananika eh, Napa, Uku, where even in Samansa died. So we have evidence. But at least that is not happening. But socialists, but it's the gather. Eh, Antonio Mwanza even had a rally. There was no tear gas. Yesterday, people gathered there up to Shiku and whatever, whatever. If it was Muliba Lungu, truth be told, truth be told, Gan Muliba Lungu, Gakwadama tear gas. But what happened? Takwadama tear gas, people were okay, and at the end of the day, Bamayo was released, Ushiku. That, as much as I condemn the detention, that I say it was good. Uliomu timawa haka inde ichirema. Mupiti di shemu ileka. Don't stop. Don't behave like no because they will see me weak. Ah 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 ah. Please. Please. Please continue. When people cry, listen to them. When people cry, listen to them. But I would want also to encourage you that where the bond can be given, let bond be given. Let bond be given. But Esther shouldn't have been in Marcel's in the first place. They shouldn't, she shouldn't have been in the Marcel's first place. So let's avoid that kind of like emotional, uh, emotive reaction. Yeah, let's avoid that. Let's avoid that. Let's avoid that. But when people gather, like the way they gathered in an upper part, that we, we let us not go back. Continue with that heart. And you can even improve on it. By making sure that ngamwa tuikata, because nifuwa nifuwa ba kuluba, tuwa kulaluba, and me I cannot promise that yo njaka wekeshe pocha na chan 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 na inenguru sometimes shira njika tam daranda semuka gana semuka mwandole shafya tawe wina ena muntu wandi muntu wandi ngamwa nsenda manji kata vya vya but ka bond mwa mwampe la fast fast eh. Continue So over and above, this is what, that's what I wanted to uh, uh, to say. Number one, I think let's be let's be fair. Let's be fair. Let's be fair to this government, not to say this case is a political case. No, it's not political. It is a case that is started away from politics between two parties two parties and then you know people did not exercise graciousness or leniency on each other 
because you can't say no i was lenient when you muntu alimpo kenganda wa mpo kana moto ka you can't say you are lenient no you can't say that you can't say that then nabo wa nabo wo obo wa obo wa the people who brought also these things who they whatever now they have gotten power now they go to the police and they are they want to fix i mean you can discuss this issue you can get your vehicles you can get your house I'm sure Mama Eva by Esther Lungu can also forget about the money. Can also forget about the money. And you go on. You go on. This is a case that can be resolved. Other than looking forward to Ukuya Kuma court. Other than looking forward to Ukuya Kuma court. If I were a lawyer near these people, I would be saying, let us go and talk to that family. Let us resolve this matter. That's what I would be saying. That's what I would be saying. Let us sit and resolve this matter. Then going kuma court. Ukuya kuma court. Uh-uh. Uh-uh. Tafia kawame. Tafia kawame. Ukuya kuma court. Ngele andafim. Ndiya sapano na amie, but this case, this case is not going to court. This case will not go anywhere. But this case, going to court, is not a good case to go to court. This is not a good case to go to court. This is, this case, you are better off resolving it before you go to court why should you be going to court you can resolve this case remove the politics remove the politics those of you police those of you who have got powers remember you have got this connection but tomorrow you might not have the connection so in nami papata nami papata see how you can resolve this 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 matter on the table and ikapwe ikapwe kudiba hh you are fixing you are fixing truth be told you are fixing us you are fixing us but now kwa takwa kamutima akamutima akamupitirishe mupitirishe continue being soft you know soft hearted god will bless you god will bless you being soft hearted god will bless you god will bless you even some of these things which are be, being a problem if you are good to people god blesses you you will realize that some of the challenges that you are having even in government to sort out god will come and help you when you are being good to people be that good leader with a soft heart continue like this improve on it so that we reduce on our muscles let us even reduce on that when you do that god will see the good the good leader in you and he will help you no wunga wuka chipa. Na fiweo hika chipa le saka miafua. Because you are being good to people. Because you are being good. God will help you. This country will be blessed. Continue. Those walaba likunse, mweba likunse. Sana sana imweba PF. As much as you condemn this government, you should also go back and look where you are coming from. Because you are also not innocent. Na imwe. You used to fix other people. But and you were banned. Remember? Eh? Aba Kashwaba Arabi. Mwadiwekete. You arrested her. You 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 searched her, you did what? So come on, when you are also pointing fingers at others, look at where you are coming from. Because sometimes ni lesana ena to teach you a lesson. Fiawale chitakuba nove. God also will allow you to pass through certain things. So nedo mule landa landa. Hey, uyu muntu muvi sana. Uyu muntu muvi sana. Mule shayifoko tu wafuma tu alishani. How did we treat others? Eh? Na pape na pamule wa. Ah, tayari what what? Tayari what what? You should remember. How did you treat me? How did you treat me? Eh? How did you treat me? So fimu efi. But I'm not bitter. Mie ingana isa mpawa. I will not go for anyone. And I'm not saying this out of bitterness. No. I just want to remind you that where you are coming from, you also did terrible things. So, nangumule asa muna akano pala mule landa mule landa. Mule, mule ivukisha ako. Mua chefi ako. Mua chefi ako. Anyway, I'm going for a meeting somewhere here. Bye for now. Tuala landa kuli mpipa 20 hours. Mishe pala refi ako landa after na landa. Anyway. We will see. I'll let you know if I will talk at 20 hours. Bye for now. This is DJ Mutati exclusive.
Alright, that's all for you today, lovely viewers. If you did enjoy the video, please don't forget to leave a comment in the comment section below. Tell me what you think about the video you just watched in the comment section below. I'll be super glad to hear from you, lovely viewers. Once again, I go by the name of Mutatim Pondum. I love you, peace. I gotta go.